Hi everyone, welcome to this Gmail video with the latest updates of Q4 in 2020. Let's start it with the first one. Add-ons are now available within your Gmail interface as well. So on the right side of your screen, you can use the plus icon to get add-ons and install them to get things done faster, to work more efficiently. For example, I have in installed the Salesforce add-on, the yet another mail merge add-on. So all applications or add-ons that enable me to work more efficient and productive to integrate my CRM uh, applications, etc., natively in your Gmail. So those are um, are available for you um, based on the business applications that you use, or if you need functionalities like uh, translating of your email, you can all get them in these add-ons and install the most relevant for you. Um, so as you can see, there are a lot of different um, applications available and using the drill down here to filter down on, um, for example, task management add-ons that you would like to have in your Gmail. A second functionality available in Gmail interface is the active button here on the right top corner where you can change um, your, your availability towards your colleagues. For example, you can um, change to do not disturb and set a timing in the period to which they cannot disturb you or in which your chat notifications are muted. Or you could even say that your status is away. So to keep on focusing on your tasks and not getting disturbed by new email notifications, new chat notifications for a certain moment in time. So these are three new functionalities from within the Gmail interface to mute chat notifications and new mail notifications or you can go along and, and change the chat not notifications solely. Now, a third and very nice functionality that was added uh, towards Gmail is um, natively opening or editing office files that you receive from your clients or customers or um, people that you work together with. So for example, I have here an email from my colleague um, Costa who asked me to sign a certain so opening the Word file directly by clicking on the pencil, which opens in Google Docs directly. So no preview mode or uh, conversion any longer. And the other way around is possible as well. So from within the file, I could email back. So I have different options. I can reply with this file with my changes attached. I can just open the original um, message or I can create a new email with this file attached and then send it to um, the person that I'd like. I can even change the format of um, the file or what is most relevant indeed, just reply back with this file to the original message. So you see in a new window, the email editor is loaded and the file will be attached towards the new message that I'm creating. So voila, so right below the same email, I'm replying back to Costa with the file attached um, into that were the updates of Gmail. Let's see each other soon. Bye.